Once a thriving mall in Rutland it will be closing its doors. The owners of the Diamond Run Mall say changes will be made. Now it's unclear right now what exactly will happen, but those who work there say really they have mixed emotions. Local 22's Courtney Adelman went to the mall to learn more. Courtney? Morning, Glenn. According to the town officials, multiple businesses in the mall were issued eviction notices last week. And this comes before owners of the mall announced to close and redevelop. I went over to the mall to see what comes next for the town and for the business owners. This mall and, and malls across America, quite frankly, uh, with similar demographics to ours, are struggling with the internet and retail transitioning um, to places like Amazon. We know that malls are struggling, and unfortunately, ours is no different than many other places. Josh Terenzini is chair of the Rutland Town Select Board. He says he's met with Zamias Services, the Pennsylvania based company that owns the mall. The group says it has plans for redevelopment. We envision uh, through discussions with Zamias, it's, it's, it's only going up. Uh, they have plans to repurpose it for some multi use um, retail and things like that. And besides for that, this, the details are a little bit cloudy right now. Some business owners admit they're disappointed. It's kind of the end of an era. You know, I grew up with this place and um, I've seen so many people come and go through here, and it's a little sad to. See a lot of friends uh, at businesses kind of struggling and seeing, trying to figure out what to do next. Meshack Turney is no stranger to the mall. He began working at his dad's kiosks shortly after the mall opened. 20 years later, he now owns his own store. Turney said he was already thinking about moving and will now open up his shop downtown. Just the rumors and stuff lately, we said, all right, we got to do it now. So we're not waiting around to see what happens here because nobody's telling us anything. Longtime shoppers are sad to see them all close. I love it because I can walk here, especially in the inclement weather, and I came here all last winter until it got warm, and then I was planning to come all this winter, and I'm so disappointed that it's going to close because I don't know where I'm going to walk now. Town officials, however, say they have reasons to remain optimistic. If, if a quarter of what happens here, um, or a quarter of the plans that Zamias has happens here, it's going to be one of the greatest things that's happened in Rutland Town in a very long time.